how can you believe in the existence of God? And if you believe in his existence, considering the state of this world, how can you actually believe that he has a hand in anything that happens here? God is in everything that we do. Everything that we see, everything that we feel, every, everything that we hear. Well, then maybe your God is deaf as well as blind. What? There, there are children starving in the streets, children being murdered and abused. What God would permit that sort of thing to happen? You're looking at it all wrong. God doesn't make these people do those things. He gives us free will. And it's our responsibility to use that wisely. We follow his word and we follow the teachings of the Bible. The Bible is a fairy tale. It is metaphorical, not literal. At best, it was written to tell us that if we are not good, we will go to hell and we will be punished for our bad behavior, like naughty little children. It was written to teach us that God loves each and every one of us. And that we're not alone. With all the technology we now have, uh, carbon dating and telescopes that reach far into outer space and proof of dinosaurs and primitive man and evolution, you still believe in a white bearded man sitting up in the sky somewhere waiting to bring a chosen few up to heaven on judgment day? Where is your mind, your reason? Is that what, this what your God believes in? Anger, vengeance. Everyone, please calm down. This man is lost. It's our job to help him find the Lord. I am not lost. You are all lost, like the blind leading the blind. That is not what you are supposed to have learned. This it's is not blasphemy. God. You hear it's manly. You're gonna burn in hell. You, you are in no position to judge God. God. Let's go. Can we go? Come on, let's go. Come with me. I like it out there. <laughs> you like it.